Explain yourself. Explain yourself. Happy Saturday! Me and Bentley are going on an adventure. And my phone's ringing. We're going to Pets Plus! Yay! So fun, so fun. Yeah, nothing happened today. I literally slept until like 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, not like straight through, but... Where the heck is the stupid store? There it is. Yeah, I slept till like 5. Well, I didn't sleep till 5, but today was definitely a bed day. And Bentley slept with me too. He slept all day because he's lazy like his mommy. Actually, I'm just really tired because I work on a very busy plantation. He keeps barking at my Starbucks cup and it's really annoying. He's not gonna do it now because I'm filming him. Maybe I should just film when I drink from my cup and then he won't bark. Like he was going crazy. I'm like, what is your problem, bro? He's like, I don't like your Starbucks cup. And I'm like, weirdo. Give me cute face. You're not gonna get 800 toys. You're not gonna get anything. We're just gonna go look. Hola mi gente. I just got home. I went to hang out with Brandy Bear. She's back from her sabbatical. Look who escaped again. We're gonna have to get you a better crate. Usually, he'll always go in his box, but show him. Mm-hmm. Explain yourself. Explain yourself. You want Pow Pow? I'm not gonna punish him because I was gone for like three hours. I don't know when he did it, so there's no point in punishing him because he won't know what I'm punishing him for. You little pooper. You you know better than that. You poop butt. Poop butt. Poop butt. And you got all these nice things today. You got a ball. Whoops. But we're going to give this to Molly Moo because you have too many balls. And you got this cool cup for when we go to the park so you can drink real quick and you can make it different sizes. I should have got two. I'm a dumbass. I should have got one for food and then one for food. <laughs> Mommy fail. And we got you a harness that does not fit you. And we tried it on in the store and then once he walked around with it. Oh, seven to ten pounds. He's six. I cannot find a harness. They're either way too small or way too big. I'm not winning. So we're going to see if we can return it. I don't know where the receipt went, so... Oh. 10.49. Is it worth driving all the way back there? Because we went to a different pet store that was far away. I guess it is. What else did we get? Bentley got lots of stuff today. We got some wet food, which I'm totally against, but... We're having some food problems. He was so aggressive. He, not aggressive, but I notice he's starting to guard his food. I don't know if it's because he's super hungry because he's still transitioning from rice to kibble. Did he pee on the floor? I feel like I need to walk around barefoot and look for evidence. Look at this. So bad. I'm gonna eat you. I'm gonna have to put this back together. You little fudge nut. I feel like I should do something constructive but it's 12 o'clock in the morning. I should probably wind down and go to bed. But I feel like I should clean. So maybe I'll clean. I need to wash his potty grass. We wash it once a week. So we have fresh, fresh puppy. Yeah, maybe I'll wash it now and then I won't have to deal with it tomorrow. Easy peasy. I wash it with all free and clear, and I put two packs in, some extra. You're supposed to use a gentle detergent, and I sprinkle baking soda. Use a little bit of bleach. Gentle cycle, cold water. Potty box is clean, and then I got into a really weird mood, and I decided to completely scrub down my bathtub, because there's like this little line of like funk. Mill is that like mildew, shower gook? So I scrubbed that with mistoline bleach, <laughs> baking soda, and bleach spray. 
I like to make scientific concoctions to clean with that'll probably kill you, so don't do it. And look who piddled on the floor. Show him what you did, Bentley. I didn't, I didn't do it. You were, you were cleaning my potty boxes. Where was I supposed to go? Good point. So he's not in trouble for that. Usually when I clean them, because I did a full cleaning where I took all the pieces out and I sprayed them down with bleach and Lysol and sanitized them and cleaned them with simple solution. I usually just wash the grass and just kind of wipe everything off real quick. But since I did a deep, deep cleaning, he had no access. But his box would have been right here, so you get two points. One, two. You don't get a cookie, though. So his potty grass and his boxes have been cleaned and refreshed, and he's happy. He missed them, and now he's going to pee on it because it's his. Or not. So it's 1.30. His area is put together. And I'm like, turn down for what? Let's do more laundry. But I ran out of my Suave Tail Fresca Primavera. But I always have a backup. I got Suave Tail Manatiel de Islas. Yeah, you gotta get with the Suave Tail and the Mistoline if you wanna clean, clean. And yes, it's a Latin American product found in many Latin American homes. I grew up with many Latin American friends. I think my mom even uses Swabby Tail. See what happens when you live in the barrio when you grow up? Before you get on my case, it's hecho in America. Made in America. Go Merca. I'm so hyper. It's, see, this is what happens when you stay in bed till 5. I didn't sleep till 5, but I stayed in bed till 5. <laughs> I'm going to call it a night because I'm on a 1.30 in the morning cleaning frenzy. I started another load of laundry of towels. My bathroom is sparkling clean. I cleaned my room my vanity, and now we're going to attack the living room even though there's not much to attack. I need to take some NyQuil and turn down. You say bye to all your friends, my bubbles. Say goodnight, give them all the kisses. Kisses, oh thank you, they love it. Give them more kisses. And say bye. Bye guys. My mom's crazy, she's cleaning everything, it's so annoying. But she'll play with me later, cause she's, she's OCD, she's like a maid. Yeah. I. I'm gonna go chase this. Bye!